Welcome to Pinoy Guard Channel. Today, we're diving deep into the realm of national defense as we explore the cutting-edge technologies being considered by the Philippine Armed Forces. Our focus? The formidable ReHorizon 3 program. In our quest to fortify the nation's security, the Philippine Armed Forces has launched the ReHorizon 3 program, aimed at safeguarding vital installations and military units from aerial threats. At the forefront of this defense initiative are two remarkable systems, iDome and Spider AIO. iDome, armed with state-of-the-art radar technology, boasts a detection range of up to 50 kilometers. Its swift response capabilities make it a formidable adversary against airborne threats, ensuring our skies remain secure. Meanwhile, Spider AIO offers an extended reach, with a detection range of 60 kilometers and interception capabilities up to 25 kilometers. Its mobility and versatility make it a force to be reckoned with. Before continuing the discussion, don't forget to like, subscribe, and hit the notification bell to stay updated with our latest content. In an effort to bolster national defense, the Philippine Armed Forces has launched the ReHorizon 3 program aimed at enhancing protection of vital installations, infrastructure, and military units from various air threats. One solution under consideration is the deployment of short-range air defense SHORAD, systems such as iDome and Spider AIO. iDome capability iDome is equipped with highly advanced multi-mission radar, enabling detection and tracking of targets up to a range of 50 kilometers. This allows the system to provide early warning and rapid response to airborne threats emerging from various directions. The vertical launchers of iDome can accommodate up to 10 Tamir interceptor missiles. These missiles are reliable guardians with agile and accurate interception capabilities. Capable of reaching targets up to 15 kilometers away and at an altitude of 10 kilometers, the Tamir missile ensures optimal response to various threats, including cruise missiles, long-range rockets, drones, and aircraft. Command and control system The key to iDome's effectiveness lies in its sophisticated command and control system. With remote operation and control capabilities, operators can easily monitor the airspace, prioritize targets, and respond swiftly and accurately to threats. This enables users to keep crucial installations, vital infrastructure, and military units safe and protected. Comparison of iDome with Spider AIO Meanwhile, Spider AIO, Air Defense Interceptor on the Move, is another SHORAD system being considered by the Philippine Armed Forces. Here's a comparison between iDome and Spider AIO. While Spider AIO also is a considered SHORAD system by the Philippine Armed Forces, Compared to iDome, Spider AIO offers slightly wider detection range, up to 60 kilometers, and a longer interception range of up to 25 kilometers. Spider AIO is equipped with 12 interceptor missiles and has interception capabilities at altitudes up to 15 kilometers. However, both iDome and Spider AIO can be integrated with other air defense systems to enhance overall defense capabilities. The final decision in selecting the system will be based on various factors such as cost, availability, and specific operational requirements. It is important to compare features and capabilities between the two leading solutions, iDome and Spider AIO. iDome. Conclusion It is important to remember that both iDome and Spider AIO are solutions that meet the standards of the Philippine Armed Forces needs for short-range air defense SHORAD, systems. However, 
The final decision on which system to procure will be influenced by several important factors. 1. Cost. Available budget will be a significant factor in choosing between these two systems. Differences in purchase cost, long-term operational costs, as well as maintenance and training expenses must be carefully considered. 2. Availability. System availability, including production and delivery capabilities, will also play a crucial role. The choice of a system that can be readily available for implementation and operation will be a significant consideration. 3. Specific operational requirements. The final decision will depend on the specific operational requirements of the Philippine Armed Forces. These include specific needs to protect certain installations or facilities, preferences regarding integration with other air defense systems, as well as the need for operational flexibility and mobility. Through careful evaluation of these factors, the Philippine Armed Forces will be able to make the right decision in selecting the short-range air defense system that suits their needs and priorities. Thus, the Philippines can ensure that investment in such defense systems will provide effective protection and responsive to potential threats they may face in the future.